yeah, we'll go, we'll go on to the, the next. The next one was the. Um, uh, so I think this is a bit more of a jump in time. So this is the the the, the Manchester United uh, Adidas shoe. Um, yeah. So it was this this one's a bit more recent. Um, how did this come about? Was this through the agency? Yeah. So this one was through Jador, I believe. Um, and that was, I think that was one of the first shoots with my short hair. And you can tell it wasn't done by a professional <laughs> straight away. Well, I can. Um, and I saw the advert, the, the email, and I was like, oh, okay. So I know Adi does and Man United, obviously. <laughs> I know who they are, but Pro Direct, N- never heard of them. And then I, I looked up and I was like, oh, okay. So this is kind of a big deal. Okay, cool. And then I was quite excited to do it. And it was only a small team. And I remember I got to the studio and there was a little cat, a set cat. And I was like, oh, it's just, it's so cute. <laughs> and then I got there and I met um, another model that I had only known on Instagram. And he's with Shador as well. And one of the girls that were there were... She was from Shadur as well, but I had never heard of her, but she was quite new as well. So it was quite nice that it was kind of switched. It wasn't me asking the other model for like reassurance. It was the other way around. She was asking me questions and stuff. I was like, this is so weird. Like, I know the answers to them, but I don't consider myself to like have that much experience. Yeah. (laughs) But it was, it was really nice. And the whole team of, they were lovely and it was such a like laid back shoot but we got it done so fast and we were just talking um at lunchtime and stuff about um the youtubers that they worked with so like chunks and philly i don't know if you know them um yeah they're quite big youtubers and pro direct like sponsors some of their content or something like that and obviously the team was talking about it and like how they are on camera versus real life and stuff. And that was quite nice because then I actually knew what they were on about. But that pro direct as a whole, I had no idea before I worked with them. And then the photos came out and I saw myself on the website and all of my my friends from school, like the boys, obviously, that, that are into football, especially one of my exes, he was like, are you being serious? Because he's a, he's a Man United fan. And he was like, oh my God. And I walked into uni the next day and my one of my partners, the Italian, he was like, oh yeah, put that into the group chat just casually. Just didn't, didn't, want, didn't think to mention that one, did you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but yeah, it's quite weird to me. But it was it was fun. It was really fun. Yeah, you you say about the the team. You say it was like a, a smallish team. What we with the image? What you, yeah? When you're, you're looking at that on the team, is it how many? How can you remember how many people on set? So it was the photographer, um, and then two other girls. That was the team, and then obviously they had I think it was nine models. Um, most of them were from Jador. Mm-hmm. I think it was just one that wasn't from Jador, actually. Yeah. Um, but I only knew Isaac. So, oh, well, I mean, I spoke to him on Instagram and then that's when I met him. And he was lovely. But yeah, it was, it was a really small team. Um, but it was fine because we just got everything. Like, they were so organised that we got there. Our outfits, like, the amount of... Um, changes and stuff they were all laid out they explained how the day was going to go and then it was me and Isaac first we got our bit done and then we stopped for lunch because we had to wait for the other models to arrive because then they had to shoot their bit and then they wanted Isaac and I to stay for the group photos and that was it it was so fast honestly (laughs) 